guys, Nick Subin here for the very first edition of At Home With Subs. On At Home With Subs, I'll be taking the time to catch up with my teammates that live together. The first couple on the show is Michael Barlow and Nick Lower. Let's go inside and catch up with the boys. How do, you, how do you know where we live? How you going, Mick? Nick? Hey, mate. What's going on? Do you well, mind well, if I uh, come inside? We do, actually. <laughs> <laughs> right, eh? Welcome to the show, boys. Thanks, man. Thanks, man. Look, Roby Mike will take over from here. Nah, come on. Uh, okay. What we usually do at the footy club, we like to take fun of Nick a little bit, okay? So... Most of the days, me and Nick uh, Lower here get home and Subes would have said a stupid quote. So this week, it's only Tuesday, but Subes has got the quotes here. Monday, we rock up at training and someone was talking about Julia Gillard, how she you know, used to be from the same area I played footy with at Werribee. And he asked, who was Tasmania's Prime Minister? He's known for sweating. Oh yeah, do you want me to turn the aircon on you? Yeah. He said, I've stopped drinking water, so I'll stop sweating. Do you think that's going to work? Yeah, I think that'll work. And Eddie McGuire, Collingwood's president, he's just wondered how many games he played for Collingwood. Eddie McGuire. Do you look like he would have played football? 250 games. <laughs> right, the first segment of the day is to see who does the most around the house. All right, guys, I'm going to say a chore, and you have to say whether you do it the most or you do it the most. <laughs> the dishes. Who does hey. the dishes? Barla, Lola. Bit of dispute, I like this. Who does the dishes? I think this guy does the dishes. How about you well, Okay, I think I do the dishes more because I put them all in this morning. All these, and now they're Hold on, I think I do the dishes more because I paid for the dishwasher. You paid for it with this a voucher you got from good, good guys. I do more dishes than this guy. Oh, okay. Without a doubt. Are you going to give it to Nick? Mm, well, I think I stack it more. Okay, the next chore is uh, taking out the bins. Bin night is? Oh, what not? Wednesday? Uh, Wednesday. 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 I reckon Paul takes out our bins. Paul? Oh, Paul is okay. Sorry, ne- sorry. Next door neighbour. Next door neighbour, okay. Okay, this is one of my favourite chores in my house. Uh, cleaning the toilets. Uh, Do you even... We've got just separate, have a separate bathroom, so... You clean one. Oh, Barlow. Vacuuming. One Me. of my mum's favourite things to do Me. in the house. I would do more vacuuming. I've got that little, bought that power. Sorry? Barlow. When's the last time you vacuumed? I vacuumed last Tuesday when you, were, you said you were coming home to help do a big clean of the house. Where's it, when's it get home? About two o'clock in the arbor. I do definitely more vacuuming. I bought the vacuum as well. So I do. I do. I do. Cooking. I do. Lower. I do. Lower? Oh, yep. what, what's your special dish, Nick? Um, what's my go-to? You might have to ask Actually, me. Actually, ask Mick, yeah. yeah ask Nick's two minute, Nick. Two minute noodles. It's <laughs> pretty good. No, um, he makes... Rice? Makes a good um, savoury steak and beans. Apparently it's an Adelaide dish. <laughs> All right, I guess the next thing for us to do is for, uh, for Mick to take us on a tour, mate. So uh, I look forward to it. So obviously we're in the kitchen as we speak. Um, yeah, normal How kitchen. About, How about we have a look in the pantry, see what the, uh, the great Michael Barlow and Nick Lower. <laughs> we're, we're, we're a bit, we're a bit light on. Right? Uh, we're going for a shop today, actually, so. A bit oh, have a look at this. Have a look at this. Um, Hang on, Mick. What's that? What's that up the back? Yeah. <laughs> do, you, uh, do you turn in a lot of ice cream? Mick likes. Uh, we've had that since the start of the year. Haven't made that much of an indent no, into I it. Got that, yeah. we've got one box of cereal at the moment. Don't really even. Now look, much, right? Michael Barrow is an absolute legend. He's even got a football I just had that in <laughs> the pantry. Explain um, yourself. So it's pretty. Muffins, no, John, it's pretty low key in here. Yeah. Some muffins. Okay. Do it yourself. D U Y. That's not why. <laughs> um, that's about it, man. The George, the George Foreman. Nick got the two minute noodles out this morning, so we can have them for dinner. And yeah, it's pretty light on here at the moment. Nick, maybe the Sabo we might have to go for a food shot. That might remind us. Into the theatre room. So, this is where we watch TV. Mix TV. You watch TV in here, do you, Mick? Yeah, um, lie on the couch in here. And if on, that's about it. Yeah, this is stretching here stretch before in, games. Get on the rollers before games. How about uh, you give us a demonstration of uh, what you get up to, Nick? The uh, stretching? Really? Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah, right. we just get on the back rollers here. Just roll the back out. 
<laughs> That's about it. <laughs> Great demonstration there, mate. What about this TV? We'll go. We'll go over here. This. How big's this, Mick? She's a 50, 50 inch. Is your TV? Yeah, yeah. yeah. If, it, if it was for, if it wasn't for me, we wouldn't have a TV in this house. Nick, he doesn't really like watching. TV, yeah, I, I like to do things with my time, so it's wasted. <laughs> oh, that's great. It's a nice painting up there, Nick. Uh, yeah, Dad. Uh, I don't know what it is. Bit of, bit of smeared paint, I think. <laughs> Dad gave me that one, so. Yeah. Good. Uh, we sit down for dinner here sometimes. So sit down for dinner. Uh, you won't be sitting there tonight, will you guys? No. no Mexican tonight. Dan, Mexican with you. Yeah, we're going out for dinner tonight. Should be uh, exciting. Lounge room, this is my couch. Probably the most comfiest couch in the house, you'd say, Mick? I'd, I'd agree with that, yeah. And again, mixed TV. Oh, so that's your TV, is it? Yeah. How did you uh, get that TV? It's quite an interesting story, Mick. Yeah. I'll do Explain that. yourself. Um, I got that. Last year, during the game, I got told that I won a TV, it was just nice. Uh, okay. What game was this? We played Carlton in uh, Melbourne. Yep, you did play well that game. Big sleeping area. Your sleeping area, right? Well, let's go in and check out Michael Barlow's room. Have a look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Show us your room. Um, Show us hope, no, How about we go, we check the bed out? Oh, jeez. It's not that comfy. It's not that comfy, Mick, in here. Probably hey, invested in it. How about you come over here, Mick, and show us your uh, book and DVD collection? Okay. Um, and these things here. Oh, yeah, Danny these? Green gave me some boxing gloves. So he sent me some boxing gloves, which was nice with my family up there, a picture of my family and um, some friends and uh, whatnot. An award I got from Freo last year. Yep. Uh, just some books and Is this the, uh, the filing cabinet where you keep all your bills? Tax and all that Tax, stuff, yep. so keep Beautiful. on top of that. Yeah. Right, how about we go check Michael Barlow's wardrobe out? What are you showing you? Look at all these clothes. Is this your mum's or Is it true that Mr. and Mrs. Barlow are... <laughs> <laughs> What's this? Mick? <laughs> what is that here? <laughs> Explain yourself, Mick. Well, obviously he's, he's stitched me up here. Mate, on, I've, got, I've got something else here. How about we go in, into Michael's room, uh, Michael's <laughs> bathroom, bathroom, and <laughs> check this out. <laughs> Mike's, Mick's got a hair straightener <laughs> and a cap. And also some, uh, what do you call this stuff? Mascara? <laughs> <laughs> What's this? What's Where do you put this on? Show us how to, how to... I've been stitched up. <laughs> this is not my stuff. Put it on. Uh, How about you put it I on? I can explain myself. Mum and my sister were over a few weeks ago and they left their bag here. And I actually saw this lunatic out here, grabbed the bag and run into here before, thinking nothing of it. And he stitched me up. So we have a, we're fortunate enough to have our own bathroom and uh, I'll show you through. Let's go. Oh, guys, Spock. Alan Sandlings, everyone. <laughs> How you going, Spock? Yeah, good, mate. Good. Yep. Oh, that's great, mate. Big fella doesn't like to say too much, but. Yeah. It's good that he's here. Lucky he's covered up as well. Yeah. Uh, it's pretty stock standard bathroom, Nick. Um, tub, don't get in there too often though. No. Um, the old electric toothbrush. Lots of uh, vitamins and stuff yeah. here. It's yeah. nice and tidy uh, yeah. in here, which is good. So yeah. Got the bin over there with all the rubbish. Yeah, yeah. Uh, no, it's good. Looks, in order. looks very nice. See you, Spike. See you, Thanks, mate. mate. So, oh. and, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Holy moly, look at the mess in here. <laughs> Mate, I, I would have spent probably, I don't know, half an hour cleaning my room. <laughs> what have you got to say for yourself, Mick? Yeah, he, he just doesn't clean his room. It's naughty of This is a disgrace. <laughs> right, uh, we're going to Nick's room. His <laughs> bed's been flipped. Nick's <laughs> bed. <laughs> right, this is going to go down. <laughs> we'll talk about this after. Oh. Uh, <laughs> right, uh, Nick. <laughs> right, uh, well, this, is, this is my bed, which has a... Yeah, it's probably need a new mattress, don't I? <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, well, this... I'll just make my way over in all this mess. <laughs> this, uh, this didn't Maybe look like... This, this didn't look like this before. Um, what have you got here, Nick? Uh, Russell Brand, who... Yep, yep, started his book. I only started it yesterday. But, um, mate, I'm just... <laughs> I can't get over this. You've trashed <laughs> this, mate. <laughs> You've trashed this. Do a bit of work here. Bit of damage over there. You're, uh, you're actually at uni, Nick. Is you, I am. Uh, you... Oh, yeah. Come in here a bit of quiet time to do uni stuff. Yeah, get away from the big guy a little bit. Yeah. But uh, yeah, do a bit of spend a bit of time here. But uh, probably need to spend a bit more. You've ditched him up, yeah. <laughs> One all. And see, ladies and gentlemen, Mick's actually cleaning Nick's room up because he just trashed it. No, no, it's someone actually. I'm actually embarrassed. <laughs> Can you 
I'm embarrassed that he's left his room like this. He gave you three days notice he was coming around and he didn't even clean it up. We're actually in the process of getting a new washing machine. Ours is, ours is stuck. Yep. This is out of control, this thing. This jumps around everywhere and shouldn't really be using it anymore, but we do. We've got a, um, have to wedge a knife, a knife under here just to make sure it doesn't jump around too much. Right, guys, so that, that was the tour. Uh, I've just got some final questions for you. Question one. Mick, this one's for you. What is the best thing about having Nick as a housemate? Um, pass. <laughs> he's, uh, he's pretty good. Oh, he's, someone asked me the other day in the physio room what, what was wrong with him. And I couldn't have many answers, so probably that, that he doesn't have too many negatives. We're getting all mushy here, are we? <laughs> <laughs> nah, he's really, uh, cooking's very good. Um, likes, he likes cooking, so it kind of gives me a bit of alone time at night time and relaxed time, so that's good. Cooking's probably his number one, but as I say, there's not much wrong with him. Why did you choose to live with Mick? Uh, well, there weren't there any other options, really. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, to be honest, you were going to be home on it was either live with Mick or get a one-room place in Picton, so. What's Nick's worst habit? Oh, yeah, I know what this is. He, um... Every, he tells the stories, tells stories over and over again. Yes, he does. Oh, that drives you insane sometimes. Um, and then he'll tell someone else the, the story and someone else, and I'm usually hanging around, and yeah. so he'll oh, I'll yeah. hear the story four or five times. What's yeah. the worst thing about living with me? Um, <laughs> the worst thing about living with me, he just compl he complains a lot about everything. Like, Anything such as? Training? Training, cooking, sleeping, wakes up to his head the worst night's sleep. <laughs> Everything. <laughs> the cu couch isn't comfy enough, it's too soft, it's too hard. He's just a complainer. I'm not Chris Mayne. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for being on the show, guys, and showing us around your house. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is a joke.